the Russians are jumping quads, the athlete from Greece can be proud that she did not fall from the triple. After the incredible results of Russian figure skaters in competitions, it is unusual for fans to see how the participants in the European Championship sometimes do not even get over the threshold of 50 points in the short program. And not everyone manages to jump over 40 points. But for the Greek figure skater Alexandra Minsidou, a score of 3386 points is not bad. Moreover, it's good. These are Russian girls jumping triple axles and quads with might and main, and for Minsidou to land a triple jump with under rotation is a real reason for pride. Because high achievements in big sport have a different measure. In Russian figure skating, these are ultra C elements and records. And for girls from countries where figure skating is far from popular, the most insignificant, at first glance, progress is priceless. Who is Alexander Minsidou? Figure skater Alexandra Minsid is 18 years old, she was born in Bulgaria, and initially skated for this country. However, at the age of 15 she changed sports citizenship, and passed under the flag of Greece. True, she was not able to represent the new team at the competitions right away. I had to wait one year, and already from the 2020-2021 season, re-declare myself at the starts. Of course, it was not possible to do this loudly. The coronavirus pandemic was in full swing in the world at that time. But at one tournament, the athlete nevertheless made her debut as a Greek single skater. It happened at a small, albeit international, competition in her native Sofia. According to the results of two programs, Alexandra scored 125 points, and was almost in the middle of the table in 16th place out of 29 participants. This was the beginning of her thorny path in another team. By the Olympic Games in Beijing, Alexandra turned 17 years old, and this age played a cruel joke on her. The well-known puberty, apparently, covered the girl in the most crucial season, and prevented her from qualifying for the Olympics. At the stage of the Junior Grand Prix in Kerchival, she unexpectedly received only 7404 points from the judges for two rentals. 2403 points in the short program and 5001 in the free program. Last, 23rd place. Every skater's nightmare. In the short program, she did not cope with a single jump element. I fell off the triple loop due to a strong under rotation, and thereby lost the cascade. I repeated the same fall from a triple flip. And on the axle, I didn't twist a single turn and didn't get a single point for it. The trouble was happening on the rotations. On the third level, only the last one was completed. But that didn't save her. The quality on all elements was so lame that she did not earn a single plus allowance, go. In the free program, Alexandra looked a little better. I was able to cleanly do a single axle and a double lutz in the second half. With grief, she twisted two cascades in half with under rotations and huge minuses from the judges. She lost another cascade and fell from three jumps. At the end of the rental, I managed to complete the rotation of the third level without reductions. But, of course, there was still nothing to rejoice about. It is logical that after such a result, Alexandra was not sent to the tournament in Oberstdorf in order to get a quota for the Beijing Olympics. However, another Greek figure skater also did not get it and was left without the games. Alexandra calmly survived the unsuccessful season and did everything to start the next four-year cycle on a high note. In the 2022-2023 season, already 18-year-old Alexandra showed noticeable progress at the very first start. At the tournament in Bucharest, she scored 105.61 points. More than she had in juniors. In the short, she again fell twice and lost the cascade, but she was credited with a double axle, albeit with an under-rotation. She also rose sharply on spins. She completed all three to the fourth level and avoided declines. Received from the judges 33-28 points. In the free program, she fell only once on a triple loop. I lost one combination, I made others with double jumps to minuses. And in general, on all jumps, except for the solo double lots, the judges noticeably cut her points. Alexander did not have enough strength for high quality spins and free spins, but compared to last season, they looked good. As a result, the arbitrators evaluated the arbitrary as 72-33 points. There was an excellent reason for joy, because less than a year ago she received a little more at once for both rentals. The 2023 European Championship was Alexandra Minsidou's debut in her career. And very exciting, because she had to open the short program of the singles at such a major tournament. 
Perhaps it was precisely because of emotional overstrain that she failed to appear in all her glory and avoid mistakes. But again, it was impossible not to notice her personal progress. Alexander fearlessly entered the cascade of Triple Ritberger Double Toll Loop at the beginning of the program, and did not fall. The under-rotation on the loop, of course, took away precious points from her, but she proved that she can fight at the most difficult competitive moment. The girl withstood the triple flip, despite the under-rotation. But on the double axle, she still met with ice. It was really embarrassing. I so wanted this athlete not to have a fall. The rotation of the Greek figure skater demonstrated the third level. For one of them, her goal was slightly reduced, for the other two, she was given small pluses. I skated the track of the second level weekly and also received negative go, but I was able to exhale, which almost completed the program. As a result, Alexander scored 3386 points for the short at the European Championships. 1823 for vehicles and 1663 for components. Yes, this is not enough, if you remember what space points Russian figure skaters are gaining. But for Alexandra, representing Greece, this is a worthy result. It progresses and gradually rises to a higher level. After the short program, she is the last in the standings and did not qualify for the free program. But for herself, she won. And this is the most important thing. After all, the main thing for an athlete is to surpass himself. And the ex-Russian Gubanova takes gold in the short program at the Euro. A shock to the world figurine without Russia. Initially, the singles tournament at the European Championships in Espoo seemed to be the easiest triumph of the Belgian Luna Hendricks. In the first half of the season, the skater was by far the best of the Europeans. And after the silver medal of the 2022 World Championship, the judges began to see her as a top athlete and put points corresponding to the leader. Hendricks came to Finland as a favorite. Either from the burden of responsibility or from not the best physical conditions, the Belgian failed the short program. At all previous starts, Luna easily coped with all the jumps and did not make blunders. The figure skater was visibly nervous and cautious. The cascade in the second half is a valuable but risky undertaking. This time, she didn't budge. Hendricks had a bad push off on the triple lutz and couldn't get it back, so she only hooked on a double toll loop instead of a triple. And then she could not resist and flew into the step out with her hands touching the ice. As a result, Luna lost to herself about 10 points and received only 6785 points in a small silver medal. A real holiday today in the Georgian team. Ex-Russian Anastasia Gubanova did an amazing job with a short one. It is noticeable that for the European Championships, the skater gained good physical shape all jumps, including the triple flip cascade triple toll loop, were performed as confidently as possible, and with good trips. Gubanova did not leave a chance to find fault with the Doherty and reduce points. A little bit nasty was let down by non-jumping ones on spins she could not hold on to some positions and lost difficulty levels. The figure skater became the only athlete with a clean skate 6981 points and leadership on the first day. It's a shame that Gubanova did not have enough pennies to reach the bar of 70 points. Unexpectedly, Swiss Kimi Ripond got into the top three. In the current season, she performed at the junior level, however, due to her age, she is also eligible for adult competitions. Despite her tall height, 166 cm appear in the ISO profile, Kimi coped well with all the jumps. Although the starting cascade of the triple lutz triple toll loop turned out to be under-rotated on the first element. Interestingly, six years ago, the figure skater even had an internship at Kristalny, just before the Olympic season of Lina Zagitova and Evgenia Medvedeva. Ripon's debut at the European Championship was excellent 63-83 points in third intermediate place. Ekaterina Kurakova was considered the main contender for the bronze of the Continental Championship. However, since the beginning of the season, the ex-Russian has not yet shined with confident rentals. Of earlier Katya consistently entered the 3-3 combination, even though sometimes she was given a slight under-rotation on the second jump, now she regularly performs a triple lutz at double toll loop, losing in difficulty. By the solo loop, Kurkova was completely agitated under rotation and landing on two legs. But what cannot be taken away from the skater is the presentation. Sometimes her choreographic movements look both funny and ridiculous, but Katya gives everything she has to the program. 
for her spontaneity and emotions. Kirkova is loved by the public, perhaps even Luna Hendricks and Nasty Gubanova were clapped less by the audience. 6181 points, fifth place. As a result of short programs, two serious battles are planned. The first, obviously, for the victory. Dubanova does not plan to give up, but Hendricks has judicial authority on her side, and the recent failure at the Grand Prix Finals. The second is for bronze. A figure skaters at once, who took from 3rd to 10th positions, may well qualify for a medal. No one has a confident advantage, the more interesting it will be to watch the free program.